North Caucasus within the Social Democratic Party, Kwara State has staged a mild protest to press home their demand for the governorship slot of the party in the 2023 general elections. At a press briefing, held at the party secretariat, GRA Laureen on Wednesday, the spokesman of the group Comrade Mustafa Mohammed expressed the wish and aspiration of Kwara North Caucasus adding that their region has been over-marginalized and that an end must come to all acts of marginalization in the party. Press conference organized by the voice of the Kwara North movement against inequity, injustice and unfairness in politics of Kwara State since 1999, held at the Social Democratic Party, SDP Secretariat, No. 26, Reservation Road, Ilor in Kwara State, on the 20th of April, 2022. The best alternative for Kwara's 2023 election, the North, the, the turn of Kwara North. Distinguished party members and gentlemen of the press, it is universally held that the ideas of democracy are chiefly equity, justice, and fairness. As we well know, Kwara State was created on the 17th of May, 1967. Incidentally, in, the le in less than one month from now, our dear state will be 55 years old. Since the return of democracy in 1999, Kwara South has held has had the privilege of having the governorship seat rotated to the region for eight solid years. Kuala Central, interestingly, has enjoyed that rotation, that rotational arrangement for almost 16 years. It would interest you to know, however, that Kuala North has, not been, has been contributing immensely to the success of our politics, has not had a single day not to talk of eight years on the governorship seat. If this off-stated position of democracy is participatory inclusiveness, then this is sounding more and more like a deliberate machination of to keep Kwara North perpetually marginalized. Therefore, we, the youth and women of Social Democratic Party, SDP, under the aegis of Alliance of Kwara North Progressive Youth, constituting more than half percent of eligible voters in Kwara North, hereby pray the leadership and entire members of, of our great party to approach this coming election with sincerity and not discount Kwara North at this most auspicious time. If we are truly Democrat, which I believe we are, we must work to ensure a Kwara Northern emerges as a gubernatorial candidate in the coming 2023 general election under the Social Democratic Party, SDP platform. This should be taken seriously by the party leadership. The Kwara Northerners have long come together and are determined not to support any other zone in the race of governorship seat this time. Any Northerner for a candidate outside Kwara North is doing so as a money-making venture that will not translate to electoral outcome in 2023. Our people's position is quite simple. If the party failed to pick a governorship candidate from Kuala North, we might as well kiss their vote goodbye. The Social Democratic Party, SDP, is known for social justice and majority of our members in Kuala State have also stood against injustice by fighting past hegemony dominance. As such, this must be re-echoed in the current political discourse in the SDP if the party must win the gubernatorial election come 2023. There can never be any meaningful statewide development if there is the prevalence of injustice which every faith go against. Kuala North is blessed with many capable, competent, intelligent, and intellectual vibrant technocrats and politicians that are men of integrity who have also made remarkable achievement in their choosing careers. Politically, Kuala North is a powerhouse of no mean repute. The senatorial district had the second highest vote cast in the 2019, 2019 general election, 34%. Kuala Central, about 39%, while Kuala South 
27%. Everyone can attest to the last election result and contribution of Quara North. Any argument in favor of Quara Central factor is a fallacy, as incumbency will only serve to further split the vote of Quara Central more than that of Quara North, which as today has SDP in the majority. The people of North are fully prepared to bring more votes than even if given the gubernatorial ticket under the platform of SDP. This is, this is evidence as we, the major political grassroots youth with structure, had left APC for Social Democratic Party, SDP. Coincidentally, the only governor ever produced by Quara North for just 18 months in the Second Republic was under the platform of Social Democratic Party, SDP, and our people are poised to repeat the same come 2023. The proud dominance of power in the central was similarly adduced in 2019 for giving the gubernatorial ticket to the central under the APC, but it later became apparent that the autogen wind of change would have produced the same if the candidate was from the north, as the electorate of Kuala Central are not only capable of making good political judgment, but also about injustice in whatever form. In view of the above stated fact, if SDP fails to take the ticket to Kuala North, it will be an indication of continuous marginalization of Kuala Northerners. And our team party faithful electorate, vot voters will no option. We have no option but to leave the party for a better option that will signify the, that will signify the death of SDP in the zone. God forbid. The Otoga struggle of 2019 yielded a landslide victory because of the huge commitment from Kuala Northerners and other parts of Kuala State to produce a Kuala Central governor as the ultimate beneficiary. And it is time to reciprocate the gesture and stop peddling half truth and propaganda to serve parochial interest. In furtherance, we are warning the leadership of our party at the national that 2023 will be the second wave of Otoge struggle in Kwara State. That we reset Kwara, enshrine inclusive governance, and make the state a shining example of true democracy that we stand for unity and social justice for all. We cannot continue to play the outreach. We must unanimously agree on the zoning of governorship seat to Kuala North Central District. And all hands must be on deck to ensure victory in 2023 general elections. I think a stint in time saves nine. Thank you for your kind attention. M-A-K-U-N. Botun is K-P-O-T-U-N. And Puta is P-U-T-A. Just as a uh, quick start, I said in furtherance to the press address, I want to make it abundantly clear to the Social Democratic Party in Kwara State and in Nigeria as a whole that um, we are all Kwarans, and as Kwarans, we have all Hikwarans. You might have had enough story or history or the political development in Kwara State as far back 1999 to date. The center started it and had four years to join in the Amodi Bello House. Another central came and spent eight years, making a total of 12 years. Presently, a central person is there. The South also have a shot for eight years. Within the years of uh, 2007 or 2011 to 2015. So it is only natural if we are talking about equity, fair play, and justice. 
We are also endowed with abundant human resources. We are endowed with people who have the credibility and the competence to give our dear state a wonderful leadership. Uh, I don't want to bother the press with long history, but we, have, we all knew how Kwara State was established in 1967. And we also knew how the headquarters was to be in Lokodja. And we also knew how we have to see our fathers, have to sit there for convenience and for easy administrative process, how the headquarters finally got to Elon, which has been the headquarters of Kwara right from the inception. So what we're saying, in terms of uh, voting power, let me just take you to a close by election. In 2019, this agitation has been on, even as far back 2011. Politics is dynamic. In 2011, we didn't have it. That is how it went to the south. And you recall, Kwara is sitting on a tripod. We have the Kwara Central, we have the South, we have the North. If you go back to maybe 1990 or 91, that is before the creation of Kogi State, Kwara not has a shot for 18 months or thereabout. Well, because of the interception of the military rule, up to 1998, 99. Democracy come back to this country. And just as I've said earlier, we all knew what the development had been to now. So it has been a persistent and consistent agitation of the good people of Kwara North. That this time around, we cannot be more patient than all the sacrifice we've taken in the past. Local governments, I'm also a member of uh, Kwara North. Uh, what we are trying to do today is that if you look at this press conference, it is full of youths. And it is we, the youths, that have stood up and said, this time around, uh, we want governorship as uh, slot to go to the Quarrel North. And if you look at Quarrel North, it is comprises of five local governments. Moro, Barutin, Kayama, Edu, Patiji. And if you look at the trends of governance in Kwara State, uh, you discover that uh, it was during Alahaji Saba Lafiaji that Kwara North have ruled Kwara State for just two years during <laughs> less, even less than two years during his uh, uh, tenure. So this time around, we have consulted all the party stakeholders. It is not that we are just doing it on ourselves, no. We've consulted all the uh, 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 party stakeholders in all Quara notes that this time around, we are going to produce a sole governorship candidate that will represent and contest for the governorship slot in Quara notes. Uh, Quara notes have been marginalized for long period of times. If you look at Quara State, Central has spent many years, Quara South has spent many years. It is only the Quara North hmm, that remains to, to rule the Quara State. And that is what we are agitating for. We don't want any marginalization anymore. So that is why we are here today, that Quara North we were, we are, we've, we've exercised present enough for the two geopolitical zones, that is the, 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 the central and the south. In our Rukwa Allah, Yasamu, one and water, Naro Madana, Albarka, Ubangi Allah, the Democracy Bush Lafia, Allah, Samagamash Lafia, Allah Hirendi Kitchkinshi, Allah, Sada Murisu. Kuma Kura Kuran Demoki, a chicken, Allah, Kari Murisu. So a matayina na sunana Zakar Abubakar uh, from daga Kayama local government Kwara State Nima ma zan yi tsokaci akan abunda ya dame mu a Kwara North 
wannan party da aka fitar da shi SDP muna bukatar canji na governor a kwara north da iznin Allah insha Allah kuma Allah muna roƙon shi ya taimaka mana ya sa mu ci nasara akan haka ubangiji Allah ya sa mu ci nasara akan haka Allah kuma ya ba mu hadin kai Allah ya ba mu hadin kai kuma ya ba mu jama'a wanda muke tunanin za su zo su yi mana aiki tsakani da Allah ubangiji Allah ya ba mu gwamno a kwara north muna bukata Sunnah Gala yi cha na kiya zan na ga yi shwe yi wa gavana. Since to <hesitation> to nga nineteen ninety nine yi be yi na na. Sha ba la fi a gi na yi sana to yafo che yi na mu de de gavana di for eighteen month. And eighteen month yi mu chi mong kwi ya yi wa gavana kwa na to. Wu wa yi ma yi a kwi chi ni yi wa be da yi so kwi ga so kwi chi ta ma kwo. Da kwa ra san tra be kwa ra sa uti. A la gwa fi a supporti yi suwe zan na E bwa na yi ya yi lo Yi ma la gana yi ya lo bia A di ta ma ko a vote ya yi Dan SDP bo Yi ma ba ni yi fi Pati sekete ya ten SDP bo Tu pati na ke na PDP Be APC yi E ba yi ba abu yi la ki ka na A dan yi ni mbo na E bwa gwa yi wa ta ma ko biso kwe be tuchu yi Angi ya supporti ya Governorship yang kuarano. Senang meja dia lah.
but the soldiers of the party who have stood up to fight for the equity and justice we have been treated and it has been for long. We want the SDP to please bear with us, come with our aid, and give us a gubernatorial kind of ticket so that we will be the next governor of the corner state. So that we will be the one that will be the government. It has been with us for long. When we are in school, when we find ourselves outside the state, we feel we are one. Then once we are being in the state, we are being discriminated. Ye ye choku ya governor na lade kin kwara notino pa ime wa ga party SDP un lat ket lu ya i kwara notio e bona de ga un de ya ke ya we gbe ni atuba ni na ade ku kwara noti da ku imo yi chi wu sha bona ba na ga na chegu ta pa una o chi bi a je na na chegu be de afani ona izi ga ga na che ni na ke na de ale fi de na i kwara noti na kwara noti je ale fi je de ga so back 1992 na la governor alisha ba na a chi ga zo governor bi kwara noti bi ayan so i time don e ya saji man ni man na ki be da so ko bi en tu chi un cha be da la o na go 2023 governorship no inshallah kwara no ti aju won ya ji wu ji ya ima ji imagination da ima ki ba bi an do e da e bo ne ya ko ipo ati a age da za ni ga wa na ade ga governor la sdp bo mu ga ba so ko za ni yi wa na za o ti ga ji governor e yo ade la ti ade aga go to ticket de na ga la yi sdp bo be da la wi right choice ga ya le o ga ma ji governor e yo Mohammed Ramat Rafi.